What's up, everybody? Welcome to the Dicky Dine Show. We're gonna be doing some story gaming today. We're joined by Zesty and Tony, and we're Not gonna tell stories. Order. No. Well, <laughs> Um, I was, uh, for work, I moved to, um, Bellingham, which is north, it's like very north Washington. It's basically like the next, it's like the biggest city before you get to Canada. Mm -hmm. Yeah, whatever. And, uh, I moved around a lot for my work, so I made it up to Bellingham, and I had this, like, small term lease, like, three months, so I had to find another place immediately. So I moved in with this really nice lady. She was a, like, chiropractic nurse or something like that. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, she was super cool. Um, she liked hockey. She was fucking... Canadian, so worked out really well. The house is really nice, and there's only two of us in this big ass oh, house. Well, <laughs> yeah, giggity, giggity. So, <laughs> good job, Jared. Um, and she was like, she liked to drink a little bit. I don't drink at all, but she liked to have herself a glass of wine. And tiny uh, wines. And tiny wines. So she one time had too many tiny wines. <laughs> um, but that's what we're. All, I guess I'll tell you. <laughs> I'll go back. Wines. Let me go back. <laughs> Um, so I came home and she was downstairs and she was like, you know, did I could you, tell. So did you know her prior or was this like no, a Craigslist? No, no, no. Yeah, no, exactly. Craigslist. Casual yeah. encounter. <laughs> right. So we met, well, we met in like a pizza and in got, a pizza. To, <laughs> got to know each other. And then, uh, so we moved in together. About to get naded, homie. Um, so basically what happened was I came home and I could tell she was like a little buzzed, which was like pretty common for her working professional. You know, she likes to come on and take the edge off. I came home. I went upstairs to go to bed, um, which basically means stay up for two more hours and play video games. Oh, hell yeah. And then, uh, like, I got up to go use the bathroom, and I hear uh, downstairs sounds like, like a frying pan, like someone's cooking something in a pan. So thought nothing of it. I went back to I went back in my room. And I came back, like, ten minutes later, um, and I still heard the noise, but it was, like, way louder. Like, okay, whatever's in that pan is really heating up. So I went downstairs just to check. Because it was like one in the morning. I was like, this seems really odd that she's cooking right now. So I went down there to go check. And like, as I'm walking down the stairs, like I see the ground. It's like reflective, like really reflective. So I was like, what the fuck is happening? I thought I was dreaming. It was the weirdest thing. Mm -hmm. And I get downstairs and I look into the kitchen. So the stairs are like, you come down the stairs and like, if you look to the right, that's the kind of like you guys have. Like you look to the right and the kitchen's like right there. Yeah. And there's fucking water coming out of every, every light fixture in the ceiling. Jesus. Just what? like waterfalls. Yeah. So I was like, oh, fuck. Like, I run upstairs, and I'm like, holy shit, dude. She's in the bathtub. She drowned. She's gonna, Ooh. she's dying in this house. Yeah. Like, I need to get up okay. there right now. I need to get out of here, too. So I get, so I run. Yeah, <laughs> I'm leaving. <laughs> so I run upstairs, and, like, I, like, knock on her door. I was like, uh, I don't know if I should, Jenna is her name. I guess I'll just say it. I was like, Jenna, Jenna. And I open the door, and she's not in her bed. I'm like, where the fuck is she? All the lights are off. Mm -hmm. So I, like, I open the door to the the bathroom and I'm like dude she's in here dead I fucking know it I was so scared so I turn on the light and I'm like Jenna and I look at she has kind of like what she has what Jared has essentially which is like a stand up shower mm -hmm. and then like another like a bathtub yeah and she's sitting down in the shower and like covering the drain yeah. so all the water is like overflowing into there's like vents on the floor in some yeah. of the older houses and all the water is going right down that vent into the fucking kitchen oh my god so I woke her up and I was like, hey, I put a towel over her. Like, the shower's still on. It's like yeah. it's a wet towel now. So and I, was, I woke her up and I was like, hey, uh, you flooded the house because you fell asleep <laughs> in the shower. And she, like, didn't say anything. So I, like, I was like, okay, are you going to be okay? And she's like, yeah. So I turned the shower off and I just, like, went to fucking bed. And I, I don't think I talked to her for two weeks after that. The next time I talked to her was me saying, hey, I'm moving. <laughs> so she got really drunk, and passed asleep. out. And her body covered the drain and just flooded with water. Yeah. Jesus Christ. And it wasn't like, oh, it wasn't like, ooh, yeah, it sexy was a, lady in the show. It was, it was like, like, hey, you're fucking going to, I have to pay for this now. I'm pissed yeah, about it. I'm no. not aroused. I'm upset. <laughs> Why? Well, fuck, I wasn't going to pay for it. I was just renting the house. Well, still, it's, she you, you now had to deal with that, though. You had wet lights. It's kind of, a, it's kind of an issue. <laughs> I, had a, I had a 10 minute inconvenience where yeah. I thought somebody was dying. How yeah. could she? Um. So yeah, we didn't talk much after that. Yeah. And then a, and then a friend of mine moved into that house afterwards because like, I was like, hey, I have a friend who will take over my lease too. He's moving up here to take my job because mm -hmm. and I was going down south to work at another store. And she was like, okay, cool, yeah, no problem. And he calls me like a week later and he's like, dude, is this lady a little weird? I'm like, well, I mean, no more like no more weird than you or I. She's not as weird as Dicky. But <clears throat> he's like, dude, I went, I came home the other night. Like we had a couple drinks. I went outside to have a smoke. I came back and she was naked on the couch. 
I'm like, dude, you're a fucking liar. Don't lie. I, I was like, are you fucking with me? Because I told you the story. And he's like, I'm not fucking with you. But then if we find we find out like a couple weeks later that that dude had like a serious addiction to painkillers and alcohol, mm-hmm. and was and he was fired from the company. Oh well, hell yeah! So now I don't know who's lying. Oh, no, right. I don't know. <laughs> so to this day, I still don't know what happened. But uh, that was an interesting story, and it was a crazy time in my life. Nice. She fled the the couch too. With her <laughs> fucking puss juice, yeah. I'm I'm ending my life. Sounds like she's <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go kill myself now. Thanks, Tony. Right? That fucking Sounds like she image. wanted you to flood her. <laughs> Oh, hell like yeah. she was like, baiting you, you know, <laughs> uh, or she was asleep and you know really drunk. Yeah, she was actually <laughs> needed help. Yeah, she's like she wanted like and I was supposed to reach no, out and get her man, help, and like, I didn't. She wanted it. Yeah, it was, it was her fault too. <laughs> she's still active on Facebook. So oh, she's alive. You hit her up. And you're like, yo, you still do that naked bathtub thing? <laughs> 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 Are you? Can I hire you? That's a cool. Okay, I got a friend. Are you <laughs> yeah, having a birthday party? <laughs> yeah. Can I hire you to fall asleep in my bathtub? <laughs> <laughs> Party you don't really live in this birthday party up. <laughs> Drunk chick asleep in your bathroom. Who's freaking out? Over here. <laughs> it's like it's like anamorphing. It's, it's so I'm becoming a long bed. <laughs> yeah, it's it's trying to evolve. It's trying to become an 18 wheeler. If you push P a bunch, you'll stop it. Go give it a rare candy. Is that baby <laughs> what? Is that baby prime? Baby, baby prime. prime. Baby it's trying Optimus. to. Yeah, it wants to be a transformer, but it just doesn't know how. It needs guidance. We'll help at times. Do you think that there's a Kylo Ren of Transformers? Like a what? really... You know, like somebody that was like... Emotional. Born to fucking Autobots, but was like... Shit, fuck this. I'm going to be a Decepticon. <laughs> <laughs> I think so. I don't know Isn't... much about like um, Transformers universe. And the I mean, that kind of... Didn't Starscream do that? Where he was like oh, a Decepticon, and then right. he was like a born again Autobot, and then he told me, it was just like, <laughs> dude, fuck this, I'm still a Decepticon. Or it was like, but he like literally was like, I want to be a good guy, and then Megatron came back from the dead, and he was like, Starscreen, remember? And he's like, oh, you're right, let's, let's kill some Autobots. <laughs> yeah, I remember, I remember that he actually did, dude, 69. Do you it. remember? <laughs> Consensual waterboarding, do you think that's a fetish? <laughs> <laughs> I guarantee that it is. <laughs> Probably like, it's kind of like like auto like or is it erotic asphyxiation, mm-hmm. but like with somebody. I guess it's not auto because it's with someone else. You waterboard yourself. Yeah, it's just like auto waterboarding. <laughs> oh. you, you just have like a bucket above you and like a towel on your face, and you're just like dumping buckets of water, and like, <laughs> jerking off with the other hand. Yeah, you attach the the rope to your hand, so every time you stroke, yeah. it's like, <laughs> yeah, you're like water. <laughs> it's like a flashlight and then a rope, a rope with a bucket of water, and you're just like, <laughs> jerk off drowning. <laughs> Speaking of drunk ladies, uh, what is, who the fuck is that supposed to be? Like Neil Goldberg? I don't know. That's not a person. <laughs> Some like upset Jewish person, I don't know. Jerry Seinfeld? Sure. <laughs> What's with all the bees? <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, him, I'm sure. <laughs> That's that voice, I guess. Uh, but yeah, my mom worked at a bar, and she enjoyed her liquor. Uh, if she got off like really late Damn, all the time, this is some like dark shit. Like, same you're Dickie. Covered, same. You're just like, <laughs> all right, my mom's fucking alcoholic. <laughs> I was probably attacked when I was. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. Okay, so she works at the, this bar, and uh, the way our house was set up is that like my bedroom and her bedroom both had doors going outside. Uh, which is creepy as fuck to have. I hate it. Um, and both doors have these little like triangle windows on them, and uh, my mom's boyfriend one time got home and he like was like I don't know, I was taking off his clothes to, to to change, and he threw his belt across the room and it shattered that little mini window. Oh shit! And so it was just broken, so it just had like duct tape over it for the time being. Uh, and my I, I I knew my mom was getting home around like two, and uh, I heard her like pull in with her friend, so I like. Just in the instinct of it, I was like, oh, I'm going to fucking scare her. So I, like, I grabbed a Snuggie and my glow-in-the-dark Jason mask, and I bolted out my back door. I went to hers, put my arm through the little thing, opened her door, and I went into her bedroom, and I put the Snuggie on forward. So I was, like, I was all black, and I had just the mask like on. Dread Pirate Roberts. And I was just, like, in the corner of the room, and I could, like, she came in, and I heard her with her friend. And I'm like, oh, she has a friend. This is even <laughs> better. God. And so I'm sitting in the back just like, this is going to be the, my moment. This is going to be the highlight of my life right here. And then uh, I'm sitting there, I hear the door open, she opens it, and she, like, doesn't turn the light on, and uh, my mom's like, oh, do you want, you know, like, pizza or something? I'll warm up the pizza. And she's like, yeah, sure. And her friend was, like, going into the room to put something on, like, on the bed, and she, like, walks in, and she kind of, like, like, double takes, and she's looking right at me, and she's like, and she's like, 
Maureen. She's like, cool. she's like, what? She's like, come here. I'm like, this is so perfect. Like, like your hand oh my God. Huh? Like no, I was like, her closet was here, but she didn't have a closet, so it was like a built wrap where the clothes were hanging off, and I was just in front of it. So I kind of looked like clothes, but I for sure had a Jason mask, and it was like dimly lit on my face. Like, so and, you, just, and you said it was glow in the dark. Yeah, right? so it was like a little bit lit up, Fuck. and I'm like in the corner, and she, she's like, hey, she's like, come here, and she goes, she's like. She's like, what is that? She's like, is she's like, is that just like clothes? She's like, she's like, I don't know. And I saw them going for the light. So I just started speed walking. <laughs> like I just went and just like, so like I didn't like run, but like just shoulders straight, and I just walked fast. Dude, they fucking lost their minds. You know what my mom fucking did? She goes, right. ah! throws her fucking friend at me and to be murdered. And then you know what she does? She runs back into the kitchen where there's no exit. And so she like she kills her friend and then kills herself. Like in a panic. And like dude, her friend her friend froze. Like I got to her and she's just like <laughs> she's already dead. Like I already <laughs> I, get, I get to her and I just start fucking like cry laughing. And like in this this herd of it, my mom's still screaming and her friend's like forever stuck in this like <laughs> had a heart attack and then like I walk past her and I take off my mask and I'm still laughing and my mom's <laughs> literally like on the sink trying to open the small little window she's just like Aah! just like trying to get out through like the sink window and I'm just like trying <laughs> behind her yeah. <laughs> I'm like mom what are you doing I was like and it's funny too because the way it is is like her bedroom's right here and then this is the kitchen. And so it took her more time to go to the kitchen than it would have to go left <laughs> and out of the house. So instead of going left, she went right into, into a corner. And then in the time I was still laughing and like crying at her friend, because like I was trying to be like, oh, it's just a joke, but I'm just like, ah! <laughs> just like, 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 I hadn't taken the mask off yet, so I'm just like, sh like shaking her, just like, <laughs> like laughing in her face, and then she's just like, <laughs> I'm not down with the clown, and uh, yeah, I run past her, and my mom's just, you know, dead in the garbage disposal or whatever, and then I'm like, I take off my mask, and I'm like, mom, mom, and then she turns around, and she just, just immediately pissed, and she's like, you motherfucker, just like starts hitting the shit out of me, and I'm just like, this is the greatest moment. <laughs> like, I'm just like getting my ass beat by my mom and I'm just like laughing hysterically. Oh dude, it was so fucking funny. Oh man. Well, that's way better than my story. <laughs> but yeah, it was funny. Yeah. It's like you should just got a skateboard, so you literally just like move towards him like without moving your legs. <laughs> That'd be great. If, or if those fucking those hoverboard yeah. existed, it's like, <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> it's like arms out, it's like oh. <laughs> Dude, it was so great. It's definitely one of my favorite, like, I used to scare my mom all the fucking time, and that one was one of the pinnacles. Thank you for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed the uh, gaming and storytelling. Thank you for Tony and Zesty for joining us, and uh, we'll see you next time.